Yo! You gotta take the first shot, Nick. You know you got to. Oh, what is up, y'all, and welcome back to another one. Hopefully the wind situation is not too bad for y'all. We're at my lease field and there are dove everywhere. The most dove I have seen out here ever. Um, that being said, I think they're already all out here to feed. Maybe not all of them, but a lot. So we're gonna hope, we're gonna hope some more fly because they are out here in this corn like crazy. Three behind you. This is my corn field. This is uh, all chopped, cut corn. And it's loaded. And I mean loaded with stuff. Right here in between you. Shoot. Uh, here we go, first shot. Go! Oh, I suck again. Okay, that was just a warm up. <laughs> Had to be the first one to fire, huh? No one else is brave enough to down there? Uh, we got like uh, maybe six of us total. I'm gonna try to make a pile out here today. Uh, I can only shoot eight total, eight. Uh, I did hunt today, this morning already, and uh, I shot seven, so I can only shoot eight. Hopefully I can scratch them re really quickly and go film everybody else shoot. We, uh, one just landed out here to see if Nick gets it. Nice shot! There you go. First bird down! Actually, probably second bird down. They got one down there. Before we get crack a in here, the new Ducks gear, check out the shirt. Uh-huh. The old Dove. Yeah, first ever Dove shirt from Ducks. Uh, if you guys want to pick up the Dove shirt, I would hurry up. Um, they've been selling like hotcakes, so I don't know how many we have left. Use code BOB every time you buy something at DucksWaterfowl.com. Um, it'll save yourself some money and it helps me out every single time. I don't care if it's Christmas purchases, birthday, whatever. A new duck call, goose call. Use code BOB every single time. Please tell everyone you know that also buys Ducks gear to do the same because uh, they do save some money. Looks like hor look. That might be a group of teal. They are not in season yet. He get you one? Is he banded? He is, he is. Yeah. Right on you, right on you, on your right. <laughs> Shoot him! Nice! Nick got another one. <laughs> Oh man, this is wild. I've already missed twice. It is windy if you can't tell. Uh, it's probably a good 20 mile an hour every bit with big gusts like that. Uh, and when they when those gusts come, they just freaking get crazy. Oh, oh. no. Another one over here, right out front here, right here, right behind you. Oh God! Oh, you don't have a gun. I forgot you didn't have a gun. I couldn't shoot. You're out there. No. I mean that's not a bad shot. I'm gonna start taking those shots, I guess. Uh, my goodness. There are dove everywhere. This cut corn makes it really tough to find them. That's I wanted to shoot them over there. Easier to find. Over there, it's all swathed and raked. And it's so it's cut really short, you can find the birds. Over here, not very easy to find them. Right there, don't go, don't go right. Keep on your left. Left right there. Might be a little farther. Keep going straight out. There you go. On that line, this is crazy. We're gonna start walking around because they're all just jumping around. Sorry for the wind. Oh, there he goes! Oh, he was out, dude. I mean, hey, I'm gonna take a lap because they're all in the corn, dude. I mean, they're all just in here. I mean, if everyone, oh, oh. It's just crazy. Dude, there's a thousand of them down here in the corn. All right, well, me and Nick are gonna start walking. 
And it's just going to be a roundup. You can only shoot eight. You're going to kind of cut the. I'll go out a little bit if you want to stay over here somewhere. I'd go a little deeper. Dude, they're all down in this corner. Look at that. All right, now we're getting down into them. There's a lot of dove in here, guys. And I mean a ton. It's going to get a little wild here in a minute. There we go. Oh, coming at you. Coming at you. Nice. Nice shot. Never thought I'd be hunting dove like pheasant. All right, he finally killed me one. That was a good shot. That took a while. Smashed him. There we are. Got one. Got one, baby. There's two. That was awesome. That was a close shot. Where'd you go? That's the hard part. There he is. I found you, booger. All right, I think I found my spot. It's right in this corner, right here. Two birds. I'm just gonna post up right here, take a knee. That's how I got both of these birds. Just flying in on this corner right here, where the corn meets the beans. There's literally birds everywhere. It's unbelievable. He's just getting out of here. There's so many birds. If it wasn't so windy, it wouldn't be as bad. It wouldn't be as difficult, put it that way. It's really windy, so it makes it tough. Right over you! Right over you! <laughs> he's coming my way. Let's see if I can help him. Oh, he's dead! You got him! He finally fell! That was awesome. You must have lunged him or something. I got him. I got a mark on him. Be right here. Please be right here. There he is. Good deal. We got him. Oh man, I've redeemed myself a little bit. We got three on the ground. <sighs> yeah, another five to go. Um, I wish I could uh, just operate the big camera so I could film all of the dove to let you see how many are actually out here because it's pretty phenomenal. I never thought that this lease filled would hold this many dove, uh, but being really close to water and this cut corn, uh-huh. It is the ticket. They love it and there is a ton of them. Holy smokes, I do not know how I just made that shot. I bet, I bet you I did not get it on shot cam, but that was amazing. That was one of the fastest swinging shots I have ever taken in my life. I mean, fast swing. There he is. That was awesome. Here we go, four in. This is the spot right here. Oh my goodness, look at all that. I just missed four of them. Darn it. What I was gonna say, um, you know what I'm about to say. I'm gonna come back right here to this spot. I'm gonna bring my 410 and probably my son Saturday morning and we're gonna hammer him. Oh yeah, smash the thumbs up button if you think that's a good idea. Better yet, drop a comment if you think that's a good idea. Because I know Bodie thinks it's a good idea. And we need to bring Harper Lynn out too, my daughter. She was asking, she really wants to go. So we need to make it happen. Oh, you little stinker. Um, here's another one. Oh my gosh. Guys, they're so fast in this wind. This wind is crazy. How is that not hitting that bird? I don't understand that. Look at that. See that? That was a, oh God, they're everywhere.
<laughs> this is crazy. I don't even know where to look. I started, I, I'm thinking the morning. I'm gonna come try the morning on a little solo dolo deal or something. It's gotta be an unreal in the mornings. Nick! <laughs> <laughs> so many. Oh, there was so many. He goes. <laughs> there is thousands of dub in his. It's 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 pretty hilarious, honestly. I never imagined my lease field would be like this. Um, here we go. Here comes a single. Uh, he stopped coming. Oh man, just watching how many are in here. It's hard to hunt them though. Uh, this, it's really hard today to hunt them. This cut corn is where they want to go. There's two shooters right there. Uh, but there's so much cut corn that they just move. And then when they find a spot, they sit down. You gotta walk them out. You gotta keep them moving. There we go, there's one. Three more birds to fill my daily bag limit. Thank you very much. On opening day, it's a good dove hunt today. One of the better, uh, probably one of the best openers I've had in a long time. All right, there we go. It's the one we just shot. He's a pretty guy. Look at him. Man, how cool would it be to shoot a banded dove? All of you that have shot a banded dove, y'all have to drop a comment down below. If you have ever been part of a hunt, or if you yourself has ever shot a banded dove, drop a comment right now. I would love to see how many of y'all that are out there that have, because uh, I find it a huge rarity to do so. There we go. on him one thing with dove hunting guys mark your birds hard when you are in thick stuff like this do not take your eye off of where that bird drops even if there's other birds flying if you shoot another one you will forget and misplace where your bird dropped just a little tip now i know we're close should be right here where you at, dude? Where you at, man? Ah, should be right here. Oh no, we got them everywhere. Darn it. Where's my bird? Man, it is so easy to lose them in this corn. That is the main problem. Just like that, I kept a, a mark on them and I have to keep looking. They just blend in. Goodness. There he is. Gotcha. Nice. Come here. You're going to need a neck ring and got him. All righty. Six birds in, two to go. Tell me, does it look like I got a big butt? Or is it just the dove? <laughs> well, back home. Uh, it is, what, three days later. And me and Evan, we uh, huh, we went and tried to hunt that lease field, my lease field, uh, today, this morning. Just kind of went in blind, figured, you know, just like he said this morning, there was a thousand dove that day, that evening that we hunted, and we had no, I had no clue, no one did. Um, we actually went to uh, the nearby water hole, that's because that's what we were originally going to hunt. And uh, I was like, yeah, I'm just gonna go drive out here and check my lease field real quick. And sure enough, I was like, is that dove? Cause it was, just, it was insane. So um, lately, um, switched to a modified choke, uh, mid range. Y'all have recommended it. I've been wanting to give her a go uh, for the dove. And I went and shot it today. That's what I've been back here doing is dove hunting. Uh, backyard, lease filled all day, not hitting a lot, hit some, uh, learning a lot though. So that'll be a video coming up. Plus, oh, so back to lease field real quick. 
Um, so three of the other guys limited out. Um, so that was 45 birds. I shot my six or seven. Uh, so we got literally 50 birds, 55, 60 birds out of there um, in a matter of 30 minutes. I'd say probably 30 minutes, honestly. 30 minutes to an hour. Uh, but it was so windy. That's the problem. Like, I'm really sorry for the audio. It got blown out uh, here and there, but the amount of dove was just insane. Backyard's looking really good, though. Got a lot of cool hunts uh, coming for y'all. Uh, found another public spot that I cannot wait. I'm going to go hunt it probably tomorrow. Um, it's a different, whole different uh, walk-in public hunt. Lots of dead trees, lots of dead trees, and that's why there are so many dove there. So be looking out for that, that will be fun. But as far as Judge goes, a lot of you are asking, uh, where's Judge, where's the new dog? His paw is still hurt. He tore the pad of his paw, he sliced it on the rocks out back here. So uh, it's taking a little while to heal up. Lots of peroxide every day. Uh, Neosporin every day, and he's just taking his time healing up. He won't stop playing in the grass with Fred. Him and Fred are now inseparable. I'm serious. But on the public hunt coming up tomorrow, I think it's supposed to be like 60 degrees. Really nice. So I'm going to take Fred with me. I'm going to need him because it's a lot of brush and taller grass. I'm not going to be able to spot them all. He's going to have to do some work for me. So be expecting Fred, Dad, Dove Hunt, public land coming up. First of all, before we get off here, I want to thank everybody for actually smashing that thumbs up button. I've asked you guys almost every video, come on, let's get it over a thousand. Come on, let's get it over 2,000. It takes 0.2 seconds, literally just one little click. Um, guys, during hunting season right now, my views are going up. And when you guys smash that thumbs up button for me, it helps propel the video tremendously. I cannot, I can't describe it enough and I can't say it enough, but I mean it. It helps tremendously any comments any thumbs ups come on guys i would love to see the channel start pulling two to three k thumbs ups at minimum every video that'd be so nice you guys would be helping me out so much thank you and 65 percent of y'all do not have my notification bell on down there it'll notify you when i upload so any of these public land hunts any of these uh teal teal is literally right around the corner we have what three days four days till till something like that four or five days so subscribe if you haven't thank you all for being here remember over at the podcast i'm giving away a dove teal combo hunt for two lucky dudes to come here stay in the lodge and uh do some dove and teal hunting with me and preston and gerald and whoever else is going to be there so if you want a chance at getting in on that go subscribe to my podcast it is always linked down in the description below thank you all for being here but until next time. I don't need your criticism, pessimism. I've been keeping it on the DL. Got a girl that